I believe Urkel said it best. Didn't I do that? On the commercial, he always smashes through the wall. At least he took two bad guys out. I'm gonna go get my car. Enough sodding around. I was the Queen's 1973 Fisticuffs champion. Pulling up in his automobile. I love your cheesy products. Oh, I can tell. What about the other mascots? There's no time. We'll have to return for them. Welcome to my flat. We'll be fine here. I have a safe room. Only the coolest safe room ever. Neat. One of those trick shells that turn around when you grab a specific book. Well now, that would be neat. Sadly, we have to remove all the books, crawl through, and then put them back. Man, how do you watch that show? Only chicks watch that crap. Vampires are sexy. What kind of boy are you? I never even thought to ask his gender. Does it even matter? Gender is a social construct. I think the kid is gender double. He's got a handle and a spout. <laughs> this conversation is oddly personal. Quiet! It appears that some of our furry friends are not as innocent as we once suspected. Oh, come on. I'm as innocent as the ghost of Mother Teresa. Diabetes, heart disease, childhood obesity. We must ask ourselves who's to blame. The answer? The mascots. They've sold us out! On the path of self-destruction. Recently, their evil intent has become all the more apparent. As seen here, rogue mascots viciously attack a group of working-class Americans. For shame. They're dangerous and on the run. If you see a mascot, call the authorities immediately. We need to organize and pick a leader. I'm the obvious choice. I have a vaguely European accent. No offense, but you're losing your salt, and the kid has diabetes waiting to happen. I'd vote for Cheddar. No. The responsibility thing ain't my bag. Ask that box of kittens I abandoned at the pound. I can't have another father figure walk out on me. I'm a man of the streets. I'm better off on my own. Brute force really worked on 300 pound mascots. Perhaps we should have gone with my idea. <laughs> oh, you like to chuckle, do you? Well, I'll give you something amusing. Help me! <laughs> <laughs> Is Cheddar Cat coming back? I'm starting to miss my father figure. He's not worth it. After the news conference, McGruff the crime dog was dragged from his car and beaten in Mobile, Alabama. Oh no! They're already starting to retaliate! We've never done anything to cause harm to humans! Well... Yo, Miranda! I need a place to hide! They're after my kind! You mean lying, aging, deadbeat cats? Well, technically, we mascots don't age. Come inside, and I'll prove it to ya. So we're responsible for the world's problems, that's what you're telling me? I'm not accusing you, I'm just saying trans fat, nicotine, tan and all, you did hook a lot of trouble in products. What about you? What did you sell? Nothing. I mean, I would have sold all kinds of stuff, but Conglomacore wanted me to sell Boost Expected Mothers. 
<gasps> it was called Baby's First Hooch. <gasps> Is that why you were never given a lovable name? Mm-hmm. They locked me in a cage and never called me anything but mascot. Mascot's right. We are evil. I'm the reason boys look up to chubbies like Seth Rogen. Mascot! You should be our leader. You're wise. You have character. No, no. You're vegetarian. That's leadership. Perhaps we should cast a vote. I'd like to be in consideration. Mascot's our new leader. Yay! I could take charge. Sure. Wondrous. We've elected a bloody twit. Yeah, we did. Woo! Yeah! Go Woohoo! Ricky. Go, Ricky! Bye, bump. Cheddar, I have a special surprise for you. What now? The three boys are here. I totally forgot about getting you pregnant with triplets. They're like miniature versions of you. Whoa, Nelly. Are you our daddy? Uh, I'm sorry. So sorry. Sorry enough to pay child support? I'm not, I'm not that sorry. Just looking at you boys, seeing you in the flesh, and fur, and... And Flash? Makes you wish you hadn't abandoned them, right, Cheddar? Don't worry, boys. This time, I'm sticking around. Come on, Everybody, free! Hi! Oh. Oh. Nope. Just a man painted silver. <laughs> this one's got a man inside. Isn't that obvious? This one's got a hand up his ass. But this one, no zipper, no hand up his ass. I believe we got ourselves a mascot. I'll take care of him, boys. What about the others? Let him go. Wait. Beat the silver one. Get in there. Thanks for the mascot officers. Hey, if law enforcement and big business can't work side by side, who can? Uh, Put him down, Tubbs. <laughs> I'm getting the shakes. I'm going to need your help to formulate a plan, secure the murders, organize a resistance. I think I see a butterfly. I think it was a really good decision. You becoming our leader, I'd follow you anywhere. And I'd like to have you right behind me. Okay, that's a new idea. I'm up for anything. <laughs> Better watch out for Little Miss Chubby Chomps. Why hunt me down? I'll pay child support to my beautiful patchy abominations. I'm on your side, Cheddar. I'm on the side of all mascots. <laughs> Look, beautiful chicks like you hold a special place in my heart, but... I'm here to help. I swear it. Mmm. Let's not speak. Mmm. Our livelihoods are ruined. Mascots are as useless as a chocolate teapot. Uh, do you really think so? Even I see it, and I'm just a diabetic, gender-fluid teenager. That's it! You people can turn into Debbie Daughters all you want, or we can do something positive. Yay! We can be tools for good, not evil. We can sell fruits, veggies, whole grains. I can sell flavorless cereals, high in bran. I'm a pistachio, but perhaps I can hawk almonds. Maybe I can turn kids on to healthy drinks, like Red Bull. Okay, mascot, yeah. you can sell products. You just sold me on myself. Who's there? It's Cheddar Cat. Open the damn door. Let's not bugger about. No, Let's no. chip. <laughs> now you want our help? What's up, cats? <laughs> we might ask the same of you, you selfish git. Whoa, whoa. Don't hmm. jump out of your shell. I was wrong. I apologize, but I found someone who can help. Huh? Oh, wow. Oh, I trust her. She's one of the good ones. Really good. Oaks. I don't know about this, guys. I know people think of you as ridiculous, no. misshapen, lumpy fur balls, but believe me, I'm on your side. I highly doubt that, young hussy. There's a secret at the corporation that can clear all your names. How exactly? 
These are Conglomacorp's blueprints. The room that we're looking for is somewhere between the asbestos crib lab and the puppy testing room. They take tests? Puppies are so smart. It's a secret storage room. It contains a folder that reveals who's to blame for harming the humans. Stop! Freeze! I'll get it! All right, bad guys. Sorry. We need to get that folder and make the humans love us again. I'm a top actress, and I'll die without the love of strangers. Singing telegram. I'll hide over here in the corner. I stand back. Take my toilet weapon. She's so masculine. Hmm. I'm kind of here for it. Hmm. Put the cricket bat down. Settle this peaceful. Uh -oh. Anybody doubt me now? Let's go. The hoopty's yeah, out go. front. Kixie, pop in the trunk. What? I called shotgun. I'll sit back there with you. Really? Yeah, I want to share something private with you. Really? Oh, okay. Dark and trunk might come in handy. Come on, get in. I'm squeezing in. <laughs> So, about that thing you wanted to tell me. Oh, yeah. I actually have something I wanted to tell you, too. Okay, I, I, no, you, you go. No, 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 you go. I think I love this I beam. think I love you. Wait, what did you just say? Oh, how could you choose Miss Beam, you dirty little seer. Hixie, let go, I can't breathe. <laughs> Yo, 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 stop strangling him. He's turning blue. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Maybe you're angry because you have a deep-seated love for mascot. How would you know? My affections are subtle. Dolly Parton wigs and dresses are more subtle. Shut up, purple drink. What? How are we going to get in? You forget with my cat claws, I can climb anything. Oh. Oh, oh. oh my god. Well, I guess it would help if I was actually a cat. Or we can use my keys. Oh. Yeah, I can see that working. What the crap? Lisa Beams? It's like an Adam Lambert concert. Can you shut your face? Nice climbing out there. Yeah, I'll show oh, you. Seriously? <gasps> now let's see. Laser beam there, laser beam there. Hmm. Oh, let's now? go, Nitin. Oh, Stop. Really? Oh. Oh. <gasps> let's beat it before we get caught on the bus. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We can just use the eye scan. I have tried and tried to get this folder, but never succeeded. Of course, now you got yourself a P-I-M-P. You know what, Cheddar, you're right. This one's a job for you. Sure thing, boo. Let a kitty cat show you how he handles business. Oh no! Oh, sweet mercy, oh, holy savior! Get him out! 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 Get him out!
dog pit wasn't our brightest moon. Unless we learn the secret only Conglomacorp knows, we're doomed. We need a leader willing to die for his people. Yes. yes. Mm-hmm. You, you gotta be kidding me. Fine. I'll do it. Whoa. 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 Careful, don't let up, kid. If that rickety pulley comes off, our dear sweet mascot is dead. What did you say? so brave. Thanks, Kixie, but can you do me a favor and stop massaging my ball? <gasps> Let's get to it! A moment of truth. Ooh. Ooh. What's that? Ooh. The noise? Stop being so theatrical. Sorry! Once we know what's in this document, our lives may never be the same. Oh. What's the secret? What's the secret? Just read it already. I'm as giddy as a prepubescent schoolgirl. Humans wait, wait. are addictive beings who are controlled by their own vices. That's it. Mother jumper. How could this be the big secret? Oh I left my cage and risked my snout. And that's the freaking secret. <laughs> Excellent job, Miss B. Miss Now Bean. bring the mascots to me. I told you my plan would work. How could you? I cried. I held you. I sang, your body is a wonderland. Twice. The only thing I hate more than mascots is John Mayer. (laughs) Maybe I should have admired American can-do spirit, even if we can't do. I just wish I could have found a nice girl, or boy, to kiss before I die. Pixie, I was drawn by her hairless legs and her freakishly small eyes. Serves you right. You'll never have me. Please forgive me. No, I don't think I ever will. That's just how it goes. You're not the only one who needs to apologize. If we get out alive, I'm going to be an active father to my sons. Good for you, Cheddar. At least the good-looking one. He's got potential to make it in this looks-driven society. Well, this seems like a non-threatening room. Nice lighting, air conditioning. Please be quiet. Don't boss me. Is she gonna have a baby now? I always had a hunch humans would be the end of our kind. Yeah, they're so good at war and self-destruction. Uh-huh, uh-huh. We should have eliminated them a long time ago. Yeah, maybe we should have. Wait a minute. You're one of them. (laughs) Oh, am I? (gasps) You're a flippin' loose? (laughs) (laughs) It's Mo Moose. That's where you've been hiding for the past 30 years. You look terrible. You totally disappeared after that whole targeting tobacco to toddlers thing. That was not my fault, okay? Because kids see a big smiling cartoon doesn't mean they're going to buy something. Whatever. I used to smoke 10 packs a week because of you. And that was just a deal with gym class. I carried a lot more water weight when I was younger. I was a pawn of the corporations. They used me. And then when the wrath of the world came upon them, they, they, they put the blame on me. So you've been working for them. Infiltrating is more like it. I started in the mailroom. Caught a break when Jimmy got fired, and then when Rachel got pregnant, I got promoted. Blah, 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 blah. Bottom line, I had to kiss the brass ring. Why do men only have to kiss it? I, I gave people what they wanted. Crippling products like tobacco, carbs, suntan oh, oil. I target your own species. We're harmless. I beat them to the punch. See how easily they blamed a lovable moose for lung cancer? It was inevitable they would all turn on us. So why, they do you bring us all here? To help me rid the world of humans. 
we can start our own utopia. A world of mascots. Release them all. You're all free now, my little buddies. Go live. Go breathe. Let the revolution begin. We will overthrow those text messaging, double latte drinking, Steve Harvey loving humans. Will you join me? I'm not sure we actually want to kill the humans. What about a sternly worded text message? Or I could kill all of you instead. <laughs> oh, sugar water kid. I think you're leaking. It's called being gender fluid. <laughs>